Hi, in this video we're going to show you a free tool you could use to help fix problems with Windows Update. So let's say updates are failing or they're not going anywhere and all the traditional methods are not working. You could try this tool to see if it can fix it for you. All right, so I will say I was not able to actually test this on a computer with some Windows Update issues because I don't happen to have one. So I read about this on Reddit. The developer made a post about it. So I figured I would check it out. So this is kind of one of those you'll have to see how it works for you because I cannot officially vouch for it, but it does seem like a good concept and might be worth trying if nothing else is working for you. All right, so it's called Update Fixer. So it's just a portable version, just an executable that you download. So the first time you run it, you might get one of those blue Windows screens saying Windows doesn't know about this app, and that's most likely because it's new or it doesn't have a certificate to go along with it. So just like with anything else you download from the internet, use at your own risk. All right, so you just double click it. Say yes to the UAC prompt, so you'll need to be an admin to run it. All right, so you can check for new versions here. And it also recommends to make a restore point before applying any fixes, which I highly recommend as well. So if you click on Analyze, it'll just kind of go through and analyze your computer. All right, so it'll give you the recommended fix, which is just the one here, which is to clear and reset delivery files and reset key system folders. And it tells you what it does here. So you might be okay just doing this one main fix here. And if that doesn't work, you can come back and try some of these other fixes. You know, clear the temporary files, reset the Windows host file, uh, re-enable Windows Update settings, disable any software that blocks Windows updates, re-enable the Windows Update service, re-enable the Bits service here, and Cryptographic services and Windows Installer, Windows Modules, Update Orchestrator, and so on. So then once you check your options here, just click on Fix Windows Update. So this says it could take up to five minutes, so if this takes too long, I'll just uh, pause it and then be back when it's done. All right, so the process is complete. It took maybe two minutes, and that's probably because I only checked the main option there, so it'll probably take longer if you choose some of the other options. All right, so now it just says you need to restart your computer, and you might see a command prompt window. So let's try that out real quick just to see if it shows anything. All right, so here's our command prompt after we rebooted. So this might take a couple more minutes. I'll have to pause again if that's the case. All right, so it's set all done there. And then I'll close the window by itself. And that's about it. So like I said, I haven't officially been able to try this, but I will definitely try it if I do have a problem with Windows updates. All right, so I will put a link in the description where you can download the Update Fixer tool, and then you can see if it works for you. And if it does work, please put a comment down below so everybody else could know that it actually works. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.